we present 3DGS Avatar, animatable avatars via deformable 3D Gaussian splatting. Our approach utilizes 3D Gaussian splatting to create animatable clothed human avatars from monocular videos. Compared to existing state of the arts, our approach achieves comparable or even better performance, generalizes well to novel poses, while being significantly faster in both training and inference. Here's an overview of the related works. Our method is the first to simultaneously achieve pose-dependent non-rigid deformation, novel pose animation, fast training, real-time rendering, and works with monocular videos. Human Nerf and Era, etc., propose to learn articulated nerfs, producing state-of-the-art rendering quality. However, they typically require days for training and are slow at inference. In contrast, we achieve comparable or even better results while being two orders of magnitude faster for both training and inference. Instant in VR and Instant Avatar focus on instant training within several minutes. Compared to these methods, our approach renders at higher frame rate, yields better rendering quality, and models realistic pose-dependent cloth deformation. Finally, UV volumes and delithas employ UV mapping to achieve real-time rendering. However, they require multi-view videos as inputs and hours of training, while our method can be trained much faster with only monocular input. We now explain the pipeline of our method. We first initialize a set of 3D Gaussians in canonical space, with each Gaussian storing the listed properties. The canonical Gaussians are first propagated through a non-rigid deformation module to model pose-dependent cloth deformation and output offsets to the Gaussian position and covariance. Next, the Gaussians are mapped to the observation space via forward LBS, thus requires no inverse skinning which is typically difficult to compute robustly. We augment appearance modeling via learning a shallow color MLP to replace spherical harmonics in 3DGS. Our designed color decoding scheme is responsive to local non-rigid deformations and dynamic lighting conditions, which helps to recover more realistic cloth wrinkles and sharper textures. Finally, we use the differentiable Gaussian rasterizer to render the image and also optimize simple parameters to account for inaccurate simple fittings. Furthermore, we apply as isometric as possible regularization to both Gaussian mean and covariance, which helps maintain the geometric consistency and realistic deformation of the avatar, particularly in dynamic and varied poses. We first show our novel view synthesis results on ZGU mocap, evaluated on the camera furthest from the training camera. Despite its short training time, Instant in VR produces overly smooth texture and generates obvious artifacts on the limbs. In contrast, our method can synthesize realistic cloth deformation and preserves high-level details. ERA and Human Nerf achieve higher rendering quality but require days of training and several seconds for inference, while our method can be trained in only 30 minutes and render at an interactive frame rate of over 50 fps, achieving two orders of magnitude speedup. Meanwhile, our method produces comparable or even better rendering quality. From the results, we show that our method preserves sharper details compared to ERA and does not produce fluctuating artifacts in human nerve caused by noisy deformation fields. Now we show results on out-of-distribution poses, which are drastically different from training poses. From the results, we observe that human nerve fails to synthesize high-quality rendering on unseen poses and produces noisy results, especially when the arms are close to each other, due to a lack of constraint on their deformation field. 
era is robust to unseen poses, but it lacks details and texture and can have severe misalignment artifacts. We provide additional results on the People Snapshot dataset. Our method can also synthesize high quality human avatars on this dataset, preserving fine details in the face region and on clothes. Thank you for watching.